Uh, welcome to JT's uh, CAD detail to layout video. Uh, JT wanted to know how uh, how I used my uh, CAD details, and here I'm looking at layout right here. Now, what what is in layout? The tools layout. What files are in layout? There's two files in this layout right now. One is uh, my junk plan, which is my my file, my plan file, and the other one is my details. So there's actually two different files set up in my layout, and uh, this is the this is the plan file right here, of course. But this is the detail sheet. So if I open this up. What is this? This is actually a plan file. And this plan file right here has uh, level 0, level 1, level 2, level f level. Th I mean, it's got all these different layers, right? And uh, this is, you know, this goes way back and stuff. Um, you know, let me get rid of this. This is, And these are just a bunch of details. That's all. And so um, what, I, what I do is I, I, I find it easier. And I don't have, since none of this is in 3D, these uh, level 0, 1, 2, 3 don't make any difference. It's just CAD stuff on different pages. It's just like different pages. And so I have it set up where this, this right here, if this thing is sent to layout at 3 quarter inch per foot, this more or less fig fills out my layout page and all this other stuff is uh, CAD details. And so if this is the CAD detail that I want to include, if this one right here is a CAD detail I want to include, I'll just take this thing, point to point, and, uh, which is 9, point to point, and I'll put that right down there. Now, if I go back to, oh, God. If you, you, don't, you don't see it there yet, do you? Uh, why don't you see it? Because, because I've got to stretch this out. And now you'll see that extra detail that I just threw over there. And so that's where, that's where those things go. So I, I'm not going to belabor this. That's that's what it is. It's just it's just sent to layout, and and I'll do uh, and for uh, my uh, my roof, for my roof. If I come over to here, here's my roof stuff. You know, I, I sent this to layout, and that's that's on my uh, roof framing plan, I believe. Twelve, eleven. Yeah, those are the details. You know, I don't have a lot of details. It's just a little addition, not much to it. And so those are the things right there. And if I if I decide I want to add this detail, if I need this detail to it, I'll just simply go copy this. Uh, nine point to point bump, and it should pop into the right location. Yeah, and now it's over here. See, P pretty easy. Now here's one thing that 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 when I I did a video on this one other thing, and that is suppose suppose it's not layout. So I want to send it to layout, right? I'll I'll bump, and I send it to layout at three quarter inch, point seven five. But this is one thing I don't do. Ah. Use layout line scaling. I did a video on this, and I didn't. I didn't. It didn't work for me, or whatever. I just didn't do it. I don't use it. Now I'm going to try it to see if it was fixed, or if I know now know how to use it. Use. So I want to find out what the difference is between the two views that I've sent to layout. There it is, right there. I resent it. Let's see the difference. Let's see if I can see a difference between use layout scaling and not use layout scaling. Do I have my, uh, turn it on, turn it off, okay. It is now on. I know my uh, line weights are on, that's the point. I mean, do you guys see a difference between, why is my computer so slow again? I swear to God, I'm gonna just scream. I'm going to compare this one detail. I think so. You know what I th what I think layout scaling is is it the line weight should be different because depending upon the scale it's sent to layout, they don't look any different to me. Those line weights don't look any different to me. I would have thought they would have been different, I guess. I don't know. I mean, does that line... <sighs> Who cares? Anyway, JT, that's, uh, that's how I do it. I, I, I don't use... I don't understand layout line scaling still. I still don't get it. <laughs> I think layout line scaling is... Dep All right, I'll try it one more time. F6. Uh, this is my details junk. Yeah, I'm gonna send this. I'm gonna send this to. 
Uh, how, about, how about if I alt bump? Do I use layouts? I don't use layout scaling this time. Current view, three quarter inch, 0.75. So now let's see. I, I think I've done it both ways now to confirm. That's all I'm doing, trying to confirm. Let's see if those are any different. Oh, oh my gosh. I get back from my vacation and my um, Google Chrome doesn't work. So someone infiltrated and did something. I don't. I don't see a difference. I mean, do you guys see a difference? I just. I mean, I don't. And by the way, for these things right here, I don't know if I have a good example of it right here, but uh, oh, I don't. Oh, I know. This is this is what I do when I do these this CAD stuff. Uh, I'm slowly getting better at this. You, if I put this on, is it CAD default? No. How about CAD default light? Light. I got a nail back, back there. Watch this. And this is sort of how I, there, now you see that's a nice lighter line. So that's, that's, uh, that's how I control my line weights. I don't, I don't change. I don't come over here and change the line style right here. It's all by layer. I just simply put those two vertical lines on a different layer, which has a different line weight, and that's how I control my line weights. And this line, line layout scaling, <laughs> look it up. Maybe it works for you, but it doesn't work for me. So two, two things on this thing I covered. I covered how, do I, how I deal with my details, CAD details. They're actually in a separate plan file. And I just send it over. Oh, hey, I, I know what I wanted to do. There's one other thing I wanted to do. Uh, oh, here, yeah. Now, now suppose, you want, suppose you want this particular detail to be at a bigger size. Okay, let's see. Uh, I want to send this at, uh, uh, instead of three quarters, I want to send it at uh, 1.5. Is that right? And I don't use layout scaling. Current screen. Yeah. So here's an example. You know, all these things are drawn at uh, full scale, right? And so if you have all your details, if, if I wanted to send all my details, if I wanted to change the size of my details, well, yeah, let's move this over here so I can get that detail. Yeah, see now I've drawn now I've drawn this one detail, this non-bearing partition detail at a larger size. And the lettering got bigger, of course. Okay, the lettering got bigger. Now suppose I go back here one more time. And send this one more time, alt, whatever it is. Current screen, use layout scaling, 1.5, 1.5. That's twice as big. Let's see what happens this time. Yeah, the lettering stayed the same size. The line waste. <laughs> hey, if anybody knows what layout. Oh, wait a second. Oh. There it is right there. I'm using, okay, see that right there? Now I, I've just proved that it, it, I guess it. I guess it does work. Uh, it does work. I just proved that it does work because if you compare this, oh wait, compare this right down here, this line weight to this line weight. This time I'm using layout scaling. So, uh, I don't know if you wanted to use it. I guess I guess I proved that it did work. These lines right here are less than those lines. So when it wasn't working for me, maybe, maybe the difference was so minuscule it didn't show up. I guess. Yeah. So, I, but I, I don't I don't know if I like lay, lay, layout line scaling. Do I? I don't know. Uh, remember, this is sent to the layout line scaling, okay, F6. This one right here. So I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to take this, U, and change the line style to uh, 35. Yeah, see? See how it changed a little bit? Wow. 
So what am I? What, what's on this right? What's on the right here? That's yeah. See, I don't think I like that. Yeah, I mean it gets a big blotchy. But I, I mean, I want it that thick for this over here, don't I? You. Uh, there, there, you, there. You, I mean, I don't know. I mean, oh, maybe I just. Well, it's not. It's it's almost. It's almost like not. It's almost like. Uh, it's not what you see is what you get type thing. Wow. I mean, that's even worse. I would never use line, line, layout line scaling. What's the advantage of that? You see, in, in this, in, in the, in, right here on the right-hand side, which is where my detail is, I mean, I, I, it looks, looks crap, crappy. But over here, it sort of modified itself. Now, I think there are some advantages of, uh, to it, and that is when you go uh, with uh, dashed lines. You, well, if you don't use line layout line scaling here, I'm going to show you something. Uh, this is going to be uh, you, line style. Uh, if I make this a real, really, really small line, which is this right here. Let me see. Uh, yeah, that's that. That's layout line scaling. I mean, it, 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 the dashed lines got smaller, which is what I want to see. Because if I look at it over here on, I'll show you another one. Oh, um, hmm, that's interesting. Oh, wait, what is this? Uh, what did I do? I gotta think, sorry, I gotta think, stop. Okay, this is, this is what happens with the layout line scaling. Uh, the, the advantage of using the layout line scaling is, see this dash line right here? See how that is the smallest dashed line that you can possibly get, and here it is in layout, the smallest you can get. Except I've actually, I think I've actually used a uh, U. I've u used uh, line style uh, by uh, library user catalog. That I created a new line style for three quarter inch details. Now watch this. Yeah. See, now that dash line is better. So you had a chief doesn't have a, an out of the box dash line that works very well with, with three quarter inch uh, scale drawing. So I had to create my own, and that's how I created my own. It, it looks it looks pretty good. But uh, I think there are some people that like li layout line scaling using it. I don't. I because I don't get it. It doesn't work for me. I mean, it works over. In the original that I drew, it, it had to be a real thick line, which all it all kind of blends together. And, but when I send it to layout with use line scaling, it looks good. But I don't like this over here when I'm drawing the darn thing. I can't tell what I'm drawing. So I don't use layout line scaling, and that's a great tip. Just I wouldn't use it unless you know how to use it. I don't know how to use it. But you just have to remember that you have to create your own line style that's very very small because uh you're not using layout line scaling and chief uh in, in chief doesn't have their smallest uh line style is see that that's that's my line style i don't even know where it is but here's chief smallest line style right right up right up here that's chief smallest and you can see my smallest is even smaller way down here so you got to create that Anyway, a good bit. Uh, that's the end.